A full-scale landfill leachate treatment system was monitored and evaluated for the removal of major pollutants, energy consumption, and greenhouse gas emissions. The system included primary sedimentation, biological treatment and sequencing batch reactors, reverse osmosis, and mechanical vapor recompression evaporation. Samples were taken over two years from different points of the system, while power consumption was calculated based on available equipment and hours of operation. Greenhouse gas emissions were estimated using appropriate equations and operational characteristics of the system. Biological treatment resulted in significant removal of BOD5 and NH4N, while reverse osmosis increased the removal of all pollutants. Power consumption was 35.3 kWh per M3 of treated leachate, with mechanical vapor recompression evaporation accounting for 60.5% of total energy required. The roots blower vacuum pump and blowers providing air to sequencing batch reactors were the most energy-intensive pieces of apparatus. Greenhouse gas emissions were estimated at 27.7 kg CO2 EQ per M3 of treated leachates, with biological treatment and mechanical vapor recompression evaporation contributing to 45.7% and 44.1% of total emissions, respectively. The study reveals that an integrated landfill leachate treatment system can produce high-quality effluent while protecting the aquatic environment, but further research is needed on sustainable management of reverse osmosis concentrate. Mechanical vapor recompression evaporation significantly contributes to the environmental footprint due to high energy consumption and elevated greenhouse gas emissions. This article was authored by Konstantinos Tsampanoglu. Olga P. Kautsu and Athanasius S. Stasinakis. We are article.tv, links in the description below.